Hey guys, how's it going? It's Dave from Two Average Dudes. Mike will be chiming in in a second. So, <clears throat> I'm going to refer to some notes on this. Tony Clement. Um, he is a uh, conservative MP. And he admitted to uh, sharing sexually explicit images and videos online. Okay, that, that, that's, you know what, people do that every day. But there's one difference. Is... He is in a position of power. He is what people look for to screw over. It's true. It's, you know, let's, let's not beat around the bush here. If somebody can manipulate somebody else in power, and, like, images, you don't want images getting out. So if somebody can manipulate somebody in power, you know, unless they want to throw their whole career away, and if their career is that important, and I think being an MP is that important, you know, you think you'd have a little more sense than sending out pictures and videos. So, I guess he was targeted uh, for financial extortion with those pictures. He sent them. And I guess whoever was on the other end is trying to blackmail them or extort money out of them. You think a person in power and they're going to be extorted? Like, that kind of says it all, doesn't it? Now, this guy should have known better because, number one, he was a justice critic. And, you know, something else that I find really disturbing is that uh, he was also a member of the top secret National Security and Intelligence Committee. It was composed of MPs and senators overseas that work uh, um, the country's intelligence agency, including CSIS. I'm going... This guy was involved in justice committees, and he is getting blackmail cornered. Like, this guy is an idiot. I I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but if you're in that position, you can't be doing that stuff. Um, you know, and he's married, too, so there's a big slap in the face to his wife. Uh, I don't get it. I just don't get it. Like, I honestly look at this, and I say, what were you thinking? And, you know, he's embarrassed, I'm sure. But, you know, you got to wonder, uh, look at the position he put himself in. And what he could have put the country in. And at least, okay, at least he came forward and he said, you know what, I'm foolish, I'm whatever, and I did this before anything happened. But you see how fast things can happen, people? And you got to watch yourself, no matter what. Who you may trust is somebody that you shouldn't trust. Uh, this whole thing disgusts me. Like, Tony Clement, what were you thinking? Mike, what do you think? Hey, Dave, you know, I'm going to agree and disagree with you on this one, okay? With the new age of technology and all this stuff, everybody is doing this. Everybody, okay? And, and anybody in any job, any CEO, it's just the way it is. So the issue I have is that we're, we're picking at certain people, okay? Because Tony Clement's an MP, he's not allowed to live his life the same way every other Canadian is technically allowed. Because if we were all judged the exact same way, we'd all be unemployed right now, we'd all be embarrassed in front of the media, and we'd all be saying we're sorry to everybody. Because I swear... You know, at least 75% of the dudes out there are doing this stuff. So that's the issue I have is how we're fully, you know, throwing this guy under the bus because he is a political figure and he is a public figure. So, hey, look, we can finger, fo the finger point and we can embarrass him in front of everybody, you know, and all this and all that. Yeah, the guy's an idiot for doing it in the position he's in. Okay, or or not doing it, um, you know, the right way, or using the snap filters and this and that that delete stuff. So yeah, he's an idiot. But seventy five percent of the males out there are idiots. Okay, if it's not, as far as I'm concerned, if it's not affecting his job, then it shouldn't be such a big deal. Okay, just because he has a public figure and he has a job in the government doesn't mean he should be ridiculed more than any other male out there. I'd love to do an anonymous study out there and ask all the merry men out there how many times they've sent an, un, you know, 
a naked pic to some other girl just because. Because um, I'm sure we'll be flabbergasted by the number. Anyways, Clement, you are an idiot for doing this. And and you, you know, hopefully you still, get, as far as I'm concerned, hopefully you still stay an MP. Because I think you still should be because you're still doing a good job. So let us know what you guys think in the comments below. Anyways, guys, have a good one. See you next video. Thank you.